Hello my beautiful Virgos, welcome to my channel. This is your favorite fortune teller, Divine Light. Today I'm just going to do a mid-December general reading and I'm going to do that with tarot deck and this uh, coffee cards that I have designed. And also uh, I'm going to use a pull up -pull indicator card from this Moonology deck. Alright, if you like this readings, please don't forget to give it a like. And if you like to see more of these, don't forget to subscribe to my channel. Alright, let's get into it now. Let me pull up an indicator card and see what it's going to say. Get out of your comfort zone. So maybe you're too comfortable where you are and it's telling you to just get out of there. It's time to move forward. You cannot stop. You cannot wait things to come to you. It's time to move on. All right, I'm going to do three rows. The first row is going to be your current situation. And I have strength here. So you are going strong, whatever you do. And I, I have the Eight of Wands. The things are coming to you really fast and rapidly. And Eight of Pentacles, two eights. Eight is, as you know, is like the, when you turn it around, it's the eternity. So this has been a thing that you have been working long term, long time. And it's coming to you finally really fast. And you know, you have been expecting this to happen this row is going to be what you expect to happen. And the third row is going to be what you don't expect to come to you. The, the four of pentacles, we have the three of swords. This is something you're expecting. And we have the hierophant. Okay, so let's see. We have the knight of pentacles, five of, of cups, and ten of swords. Okay, so this is the thing. You are having like an extra powerful movement right now in your life and you know it, you planned this and you got out of your comfort zone and you're doing this, okay? However, um, after while you're doing this, you have some sort of a heartbreak happening for you and you're holding on to your emotions, your, probably your finances, you're holding very tightly on them and um, because you want to protect the power and strength you have. As a hierophant, as a powerful situation, as an authority, you want to keep everything in check. And even though you have a heartbreak, you don't want it to take the best of you, get over, get, get over you. Like, um, you don't want to lose your control. And we have the authority here. And what you don't expect coming is, like, you are the page of, like, the Knight of Pentacles. You are powerful. You're strong. You're very uh, stable. And you know what you're doing. You know where you want to go. And... However, your emotions are all over the place because you don't see what you have here. You only focus on like laser vision on the things that you're losing or you're not getting at the time. And this is giving you some sort of like a depressed mood and you feel like backstabbed and you don't feel like you're doing the right thing. But let's see what the coffee cards say in the situation. With the strength, we have neg like I here. Eyes usually indicate the negative er energy surrounding you guys. So if you feel like there's like a negative situation happening while you're manifesting the things you want or you have like in the back of your head like the negative thoughts or naggings going out like to the universe, just don't let it happen because when you let those negative thoughts to come over you, you start to create this negative situations in your life as well like you're gonna start a heartbreak and like the disappointment with the eight of wands we have the rabbit rabbit uh, as you know they multiply so fast they're um, an expression of fertility also abundance and family so like whatever this thing is maybe you want to get married and have a new family, your new children, or you want to grow your company, you want to hire more people, which is going to happen really fast for you, whatever this thing has been. And I keep pulling this octopus, like the eight of pentacles, working hard, doing his thing, like she's her thing. She's working hard on something. She's very skillful. Octopus, as you can see, is very skillful as well. Like they can be very flexible. They can... Uh, go into the little places and they have so like the octopus has so many uh, tentacles so they can accomplish so many things at the same time so you are very talented and you're going to be your talent is going to start to pay for it and here we have the four of pentacles we have the tulip tulip is a kind of flower just grows right after the winter so they are actually uh, festering their energies like a uh, 
in during the winter and then they just come out during the uh, spring so like you're just holding on to your talents holding on to your money holding on to the things that you want to manifest and eventually you're going to start manifesting them it's going to come to you very soon because uh you're actually saving your energy and the things are going to start popping out of the soil with time like when you're not expecting it and for the heartbreak i have the horizon here so whatever this heartbreak maybe you go through it maybe you just make it in your head doesn't matter it's just gonna be new dawn is coming for you there's a new dawn new day is coming for you and if you're going through a heartbreak it's gonna heal very fast for you because you're gonna manifest like the power and the strength that you have been desiring and i have a doll here doll means peace also means marriage so like if this is like a romantic thing uh you might not be with the person that you desire to be but you can manifest you are manifesting someone brand new someone brand new is coming and this is going to be like the match made in heaven and maybe it's going to end up with a relationship in the marriage uh, eventually it's going to end up with a marriage maybe okay and what you don't see coming is you are this powerful page of pentacles and you are the full moon you are manifesting new things and new days and new things are coming to your life as well slowly but surely because page of pentacles is a little bit slow so we have the key here you're gonna have this disappointment as it seems like it's gonna be but it's gonna be healing like because like as you can see here right after the tulip we have the key card here like after the winter stops and winter ends and spring begins the key is going to open all the doors the keys open all the doors so like this is if you're manifesting to buy a house that's what you're planning or move somewhere the key is telling you yes don't be upset don't be sad don't be disappointed the doors are going to be opening for you and for the 10 of swords let's see what we have we have the camel this is moving like you guys are going to be moving so like maybe you are feeling like um you uh you're planning to move maybe you want to move but the the path didn't open to you and that's why you're feeling disappointed maybe you feel like you backstabbed and maybe uh, you don't want to move, but the company you're working for makes you to move. But this is going to be very fruitful for you. This is going to be a new horizon. Yeah? You're just going to move away from this negativity, negative energies to the new place. And as you know, camels, they survive in the desert and they're very strong animals. Whatever this thing is, it's going to make you stronger than you have ever imagined. And you are actually strong and you're going to get better and better. And this is going to be for your own good, whatever that thing is. If you have a question and intention and desire just hold a question in your mind and let's see what the answer is going to be for you okay yes whatever that you're manifesting it's going to be coming to you really fast and rapidly and the answer is yes the god is answering all your questions and your desires are coming true really soon all right, guys, that's all for today. Hope you're enjoying these readings. If you do, please give it a like. And if you want to see more of this, please subscribe to my channel and have a magical day. Bye.